There's a bunch of street photographers out there now. It has become intensely saturated. It's kind of like they had the gold rush back in the 1800s, you know? There was a gold rush for street photography. Do you mind if I take a photo real quickly? It has become a very intensely competitive market, not necessarily among the top niche of street photographers, but there's a lot of people trying to do it now. All the street photographers hover towards the Ayla shows in New York, um, and forget it in Paris. It's 10 times more intense in Paris. Fashion Week is a candy shop. If you have a sweet tooth for fashion, you just have like hundreds of like fashionable people to follow all month long. Woo, woo, winner! Woo! Yeah. It's kind of that relationship between the fantasy of fashion, like the, the, the shows, and that's some real fantasy. But what street style is, is how these people who aren't really normal people because they're editors and people who are in fashion, but how they translate that. There's an itemization of quote unquote like alpha editors that everybody wants to shoot because they're the fashion influencers and in terms of street style they set the standard, they set the bar for most of what everybody else wants to um, emulate. Uh, and then it's just, just an intuitive hunch that you get with somebody that's walking down the street and you know they look fantastic and here's somebody I gotta shoot. I think the secret is to be like really quick sometimes, to take like snapshots, like people walking, like natural shots, because they're more real, they're like closer to reality. And streetwear is, as opposed to the catwalk, it is closer to reality for a lot of people. So if you make the shots look normal, then people will identify themselves quicker. What I like to do is have a photo that inspires a person to do something. I don't want you to copy the same look but I want you to get an idea and say, oh, I have something like that at home. So when I'm shooting, I'm looking to just capture something that, that, that I think is going to inspire somebody else. It, it's a bit competitive, of course, um, but I think that what happens is it, competition generally brings out the best in everyone. Um, if you're serious about it, you'll find a way. Um, and that's really what it boils down to. If you're not serious, then you'll fall by the wayside. And that's the bottom line. Then you're up there at Lincoln Center. The fraternity of the brotherhood of street style photographers. We gossip, gossip, gossip. Talk about the people that we've been shooting. Talk about the shows. It's just like hanging out with your friends. You've sometimes got four frames to create this kind of intimacy. You've got to get that, that energy between the people. It sounds strange, but it really is portraiture in four frames. You're just in the moment behind the camera, making sure that you've got that shot with nobody else behind it, and you click. Bye.